Hello again, it's Tim Spector here of the Zoe COVID Symptom Study app, giving an update on the vaccine situation in the UK. As you know, we have around 12 million vaccines so far being rolled out. We're getting about half a million extra every day, which is fantastic news. These are generally a mixture of the Pfizer and the AstraZeneca one. And we now have over a third of a million of you have given us your vaccine data, and that's fantastic. And we still need more of it. Now, the team have been analysing carefully your data so far as it comes in. And some of this is all very preliminary, but we want to share it with you first. And the good news, uh, firstly, is on the fact that it is working. We've taken uh, over 40,000 uh, healthcare workers who have a high risk of getting the virus. And we are seeing that in the first two weeks, there's really no great benefit of having it at all. So still at risk of getting the virus. Then after two weeks, up to two to three weeks, we're seeing a, a nearly a 50% benefit. Then after the three week period, we're seeing 68% improvement approximately, which is fantastic news. And this is remembered just on the single jab. And there's been a lot of talk about this not being good enough because uh, you don't have, we're delaying the second shot. So 68% is really very good for any, any vaccine. And who knows, that may get higher as we see data beyond um, a month. Uh, we'll have to wait and see. In terms of uh, the other vaccine data, the AstraZeneca one, we're still cleaning up our, our data and we do need people to uh, log back in and tell us which vaccine exactly they had. We've just updated the app. So please do that for yourself and perhaps your, your relatives. That will make things much faster for us and we'll get that data as soon as possible. In terms of uh, concerns about side effects, after effects, uh, we're seeing a very relaxed picture um, in terms of these problems, most people having these vaccines do not have any real side effects apart from a sore arm. The rates in the Pfizer one remain low, really no different to the uh, studies that gave a dummy shot of uh, a bit of salt water in the arm in terms of those side effects. Um, we've just started to analyze the AstraZeneca one and we do see slightly higher rates in that group, but again, uh, similar to those in the trials, uh, about 50% more than we're seeing uh, in the, the Pfizer uh, study. So exactly the same sort of things, headache, um, fatigue, and uh, a few other uh, various problems that disappear rapidly within two days. So hardly anybody has problems longer than that. So do remember though, uh, after you've had your vaccine, you are really at risk with virtually zero protection for the first two weeks. So don't go crazy uh, and uh, go around kissing everybody. Uh, do take care. Many people are worried about the media reports of these new variants, such as the South African variant, that might uh, cause problems for these vaccines. But you've got to take this in context, even if this um, new variant did reduce vaccine efficiency by, say, 20 percent, we'd still have enough people vaccinated to uh, damp down any real problems. So I think we have to realise that actually we're in a very good position here and there's no real evidence that uh, a small amount of people with one particular strain is going to take over and, and cause us problems, particularly as the level of the general infection in this country is going down very fast, which means that the virus is not spreading 
uh, and it is reducing in each uh, cycle. So I'm not particularly worried about the South African variant at the moment, and I don't think uh, others should be either. We will bring you more information as soon as we get it. So far, the picture is looking good. 12 million vaccinations is fantastic. The rates of the disease in the country, new cases, is still coming down. And so I think uh, we are painting a much more optimistic picture than we've had for the last few weeks. So well done, everybody. Keep logging, keep giving us your data and stay safe.